so this is um, a, a demonstration of an uh, Audio Technica AT822 microphone. It's a condenser and it's a stereo microphone. Uh, and I, I, look, it sounds pretty good. It's uh, I'm gonna turn it around a bit. So this is one side of the microphone, and this is the other side of the microphone. Yeah. So left and right, or either way, whichever which way you spin it around. Um, and then this is I'm gonna go. So uh, this is quite close, and back, 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 back in the room. Now, <clears throat> it's not really designed, I think, uh, to be uh, handheld because of the, listen to all of that, all the handling noise. It's more a um, an on-camera microphone um, or on a stand. Listen to that. That's even just, just the head, right? So a fair bit of handling noise. So it's not really meant for uh, stage work and hand work. It's more a video microphone. <coughs> Excuse me. However, it uh, it can be uh, quite a nice overhead microphone. So uh, for drums or um, I have used it as a live microphone, but on a stand. And um, it takes a stereo cable. So this is just a, an XLR, and it's going into two stereo jacks. It's got a, it's a proprietary cable, if I recall. Uh, it took <coughs> and. Um, uh, so that's just, I'm ju you're just listening to the direct sound in the, uh, in the camera and I'm going to stop it and I'm going to put the camera mic, the, the, the two, I'm, I'm going into a, um, Q8, a zoom Q8. Um, so there's no processing. I'm not going to process it in post. Um, but, uh, I'm going to now switch over to the camera audio so you can hear that. All right. So this is the camera audio on the Q8. So as you can hear, so there's not, um, I'm not using the microphone at all. Um, and here I am, right? Uh, so, obviously, obviously it's picking up a lot more of the room, uh, and not as direct. Um, and now I'm going to put the um, I'm going to put the AT uh, on the on the camera so you can hear the the difference with that as well. All right. Now I haven't attached it to the camera, um, but it's in the um, in the same position. As the as the camera mic, uh, roughly, uh, just I'm sort of just holding it next to it, so you can hear. It's I, look, it's a more focused um, focused sound, right? I mean, uh, less roomy. I think it's a, I think it's a better sound. So it's an improvement on the on the Q8 uh, on the Q8's actual microphone. Um, now, there is a roll off, a low a bass roll off. Now now that's on. It doesn't really. Is it changing the handling noise? Um, anyway, there's, uh, so, I'll take it back, so there, um, there are two, uh, two, uh, capsules, and, uh, they're not in an XY pattern, so, uh, if you're really close, um, I don't know if you can hear, anyway, it's not in an XY pattern, they're sort of poking out, so, in theory, there's, there's a hole, but, uh, look, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, yo, 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 <laughs> Let me show you what it's like with a with a pop filter in front of it. So p p p plosives are gone. It's um, I mean the quality the quality of it is, is sensational. Um, really high quality condens condenser, clear. I don't think there's a lot of noise in the. I mean that's just sort of air you're hearing. It's a windy day. I'm gonna go um, gonna go outside. So. It's probably the noise of the camera rather than the noise of the microphone. Now the uh, all right, so this is like a, a guitar. I'm going to point it down a bit. So.
sing in the room with this microphone This is kind of how it sounds To the left and the right, yeah To the left and the right Left and the right, yeah To the left and the right But I'm going to demonstrate some another thing that you can do with this mic is if you um <clears throat> rather than being left and right it can be top and bottom so so this is going to be the voice and that's the that's the guitar right so it's a, a convenient way to get both now um in post what i'm going to do i'm going to move uh i'm going to split the channels so that they're not left and right they're like uh, both both centered and you've got a little bit of adjustment on the two of them. So, um, anyway, here we get the dose. Yeah, so I get a little bit of separation going Between the guitar and the voice so Using a stereo microphone, yeah And one is pointing down while the other is pointing up and then I get a good sound Scooba dooba dooba bide 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 Scooba bide Scooba dooba bide 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 How about something a bit softer? I could put some reverb maybe on the two of these, but they sound pretty good. Now I'm gonna get a little bit closer to the microphone. This is like a highway. Close microphone sounds And it's just on my knee as you can hear Yeah, it's on my knee as you can hear Yeah, it's on my knee as you can hear <laughs> Sounds pretty good, I think. Anyway, so now this is the same same thing uh, But it's left and right, okay? And, and it's right, so the guitar's a little more in the background, right? Now this is a coming out left and right Over here and over here Yeah, 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 yeah The guitar is a little roomier Alright, so that's a simple, simple setup for doing uh, like Facebook Live or YouTube Live or Zoom uh, well, Zoom monos it anyway, but look, for anyway, for Facebook Live, YouTube Live, or just capturing live, that's a really easy setup because you just it's just the one, the one microphone, uh, boom, point it down, and you're good to go. Yeah. Oh, how about this? How about this? Uh, how about this? And if the, if the, oh, but you know what? Yeah, pop filter's going to be better, right? How about this? How about this? So I think that the clicking is too loud So I will turn it down in post maybe Or maybe it's uh, I wanna rev- anyway, whatever Alright, so you can hear some ambient noise I'm gonna, um, gonna take it outside now We're gonna hear some wind uh, Unless I put the, put the pop filter on it Right, you're hearing a bit of wind, so I'm going to um, I'm going to put the low the um, there that'll take some of the wind. So there is some internal foam, and I did uh, replace the internal foam because uh, it disintegrates with age. So I've uh, essentially refurbished this microphone. All right, now I'm going to switch to the uh, internal camera microphone. So again, you can hear the um, 
the sub substantial difference between the two. Okay, so uh, this is the camera's internal microphone. Now, the thing about that, hear that? If I've got headphones in, I don't know if you can hear that's making a difference. Anyway, this is the camera. It's plain. Alright, I'm going to switch back to uh, this guy. Um, now, let's, uh, let's see what happens if we put a, um, a um, further pop filter on it. Um, so I'm just going to put this on it. I've got the uh, low pass filter on. And let's have a listen to the ambient noise. So this is me talking outside. Um, you know, if you want to do a voiceover, again, you know, you've still got your stereo field. Uh, let's say it's for some some acting outside, and you got this guy, you got this guy over this side. No, you got this guy over this side. And it's like, no, you know, it's time for you to die. You shouldn't have done that. No, I didn't mean to do that. Don't, please don't help. Don't don't hurt me. No, I'm sorry. You know, you had your chance. But please! Or whatever. Okay, we've still got a bit of noise. And what happens if we uh, take the, the low pass off? We're going to get a little bit warmer, but potentially more wind. Anyway, so that's a, uh, that's a demo of this, uh, this microphone. I dig it. Look, it's, it's lighter than some others. Um, right, so... Hmm. Well, maybe I'll just leave the video up. Anyway, what a great microphone.